Guys, what's going on? Spencer here for another video, and this is gonna be a different video today. I'm going to be talking about this new product I've been taking for a little bit over two weeks. Now, the product is called Extreme Endurance by X Endurance. Maybe you've heard of that company, maybe you haven't, but long story short, they reached out to me about a month ago and said, hey, we want you to try our product, Extreme Endurance, because there are unbelievable benefits to this product for distance runners. And I said, sure, I'll bite on it. They said, document what you you saw in your own results with taking extreme endurance and let us know how it went in a video. Now I'm gonna be as completely honest as possible with extreme endurance and that's what they wanted out of this. So I started taking extreme endurance exactly two weeks ago when I started working out again. Now to take extreme endurance what you do is you take three pills in the morning and then three pills at night and then they advise if you're an athlete trying to peak on race week you take two more pills in the day. So that's six to eight pills a day which does seem a little bit annoying at times but it's not hard to swallow them and you get used to it. It's just a process that you take. If you take vitamins, then you just take them with your vitamins in the morning. It doesn't matter if you take them on an empty stomach or not. So within 72 hours, I did my first workout and I felt really good. Uh, I felt like I wasn't getting lactic as much as I usually do, but there's also other reasons for that. It was my first workout back. I had taken a down week. So I didn't wanna get ahead of myself and act like that's why I felt good. So I'm sure the extreme endurance was helping a little bit, but obviously I was still fresh. So three days after my first workout back, I did my second workout back and I had that first workout in my legs. So, you know, this was probably a better indication of how I actually felt. And this workout was six by 1K and I ended up feeling really, really good on this workout. And you guys even said in the comment section that you thought I looked really good. So I thought that that was funny as well. I felt like I just wasn't building up lactic acid the same way that I normally do. And I felt less overall tired after. Probably the biggest thing I felt after that workout was the next day I woke up and I didn't feel super sore. So I want to list out some of the benefits that X Endurance claims that Extreme Endurance has. 26% reduction of lactic acid, 39% reduction of oxidative stress, six times reduction of creatine kinase, increase in aerobic threshold, start feeling the benefits within 72 hours, and most importantly, certified by informed choice and informed sport, meaning this stuff is actually legal to take. It's not like I'm doping or anything like that. You know, part of why this company reached out to me was because they were saying, look, this is an unbelievably successful product and we want you to help market it for us because other top tier athletes take it as well and just not enough people know about it. So for example, I don't know if you guys know, Donovan Brazier is the world champion and American record holder in the 800. He also takes extreme endurance as well as another incredible athlete, Clayton Murphy, who runs the 800. So I wanna continue on to the next week of my training, which was last week. I ended up getting a little hiccup in my week. I, like I mentioned, I had a groin issue come up. So I actually had to work out on Wednesday instead of Tuesday, but I ended up feeling really good on that first workout, which was 600s. Um, I definitely, like I said, the, the theme is that I just felt less lactic acid buildup in my legs and like I could just breathe better. So after I did that 600 workout, I only had one day of recovery before I worked out Friday, but I felt so recovered after that 600 workout that I found it very easy to work out on Friday. That Friday workout, I had 300, so some faster stuff. And once again, I just felt like I wasn't getting that lactic acid buildup. I also wanna point out that there have been 12 clinical studies that have proven the benefits of extreme endurance and two of those studies are gold standard double blind placebo controlled published studies as a psych major you should know that that's probably the best possible type of study you can show that does indicate real results. Now, one of the studies was titled, The Effects of 10 Days of a Multi-Ingredient Supplement on Performance Lactate During Exercise and Post-Exercise Muscle Damage, Oxidative Stress, and Inflammation. And I just wanna quickly sum up a little bit of the discussion about it. The discussion sort of talks about the results in a way for us to understand. In the first sentence, they say, the results of this present study demonstrate strong evidence for the effectiveness of the tested supplement to modify exercise lactic response and recovery. So what I really like about extreme endurance is that it's very much proven through science. You know, as we move further into this sport of running, I think that we all understand that science is such a key part of it. Having science back up a supplement makes me believe in it so much more. Extreme endurance is going to be something that I take probably for the rest of my days as a professional or semi-professional athlete. Uh, I'm super happy that they reached out to me because this is a product that I have already seen 
very direct results from within a two and a half week span and I'm absolutely not exaggerating when I say that. In future videos, I will be taking extreme endurance and you'll see me taking the pills here and there. They'll be in the background of my videos. So huge shout out to extreme endurance. Finally, this Tuesday I had a workout. It was 800s to start at a pretty fast VO2 max pace. And then I cranked down and did some 400s after. I really wanted to get it right. Trying to find some balance in my life. I never really put up a fight. And now I'm losing sleep. What if I lost touch? What if I'll never get it right? I try to follow my heart, but I lost it somehow. Wish that someone could say it'll all be okay. Just, just listen to me as I say. Listen to me as I. During the 400s, I really didn't feel too bad when I picked up the pace to about 60 pace. Listen to me as I say. I would say from my own personal experience, my main takeaway with Extreme Endurance is that I feel so much more recovered than I ever have. So obviously guys, I'm gonna leave a link down below if you are interested in buying Extreme Endurance. Click that link below, use my code SPENCER15. This is truly a life-changing product and I will be using it for the rest of my life. So with that guys, I hope you enjoyed this quick, more informative video. I've got a barn burner workout coming up in two days. So be on the lookout for that and we'll see you soon. One. Excuse me. Let's go, guys. Nice, guys. Let's hit it, Spence. Let's go. Get it. Crush this rep. Come on. 56, 57, 58. Come on, Spence. Keep up the pressure here. Lane one. Hey, lane one. Looks fucking incredible. Let's go. 